Oh. Hey guys, Slash and Codex here. This will be a quick review on The Impatient. Now, firstly, there is a lot of dialogue in this game, so watch out. About three quarters of the game will probably be dialogue, and mostly you walking around trying to find where you have to go, stuff like that. It's basically a straight line path to get to your next destination, unless you go for memories, and you're basically a a patient with amnesia. Now, when it comes down to it, the horror aspect is very, very cheap. It's jump scares and stuff like that. It does take about two to three hours to finish it, considering it's a walking simulator, but it's boring. The dialogue will pull you away from it, considering how much you have to do. You will have to walk around a lot, and you are very slow at actually moving around the asylum itself, and that really pulls you away from it. You just want to finish it. It's more of a chore to really finish the actual game and go to the next one. So I only bothered to go through one playthrough considering how boring it got to me and that's really how it was. But on that, the butterfly effect is decent. You can see it often, but you don't really care about it I guess. How you end the game is just how you end the game. You can go through another one if you want and try another ending, but the game just doesn't pull me in as much as it needs to for me to actually go for another match of it. Maybe if you want to send someone else in, you might want to, but that's really it, there's no point. Jump scares are just too cheap. But yeah, that's really all there is to the impatient. It's just underwhelming and that's just it.